after we come to a diagnosis, we have to offer some sort of treatment and the treatment can go in multiple ways. Some men can definitely benefit with the medical management. Uh, there are some men who have got some hormonal problem in which we can carry out some medical management and definitely they can start making their sperms. And for the men who have a blockage in the, in the tubes which carry out the sperm from their testes to outside, these tubes can be repaired. We can do end-to-end -end anastomosis or we can take out the sperm from the testes itself. But there are few number of men who have got non-obstructive vasospermia. There we can carry out testicular biopsy or microtissa and I'm sure they are going to benefit from it. Middle of fertility and IVA, we are offering multiple uh, methods by which we can uh, boost your potential to achieve parenthood. We are offering medical management where some men who have got azospermia or a very low sperm count, they may benefit by giving some, taking some drugs. So there are conditions which we call as uh, uh, hypogonadotropic hypogonadism where there are no hormones in the body and as a result of which the sperms are not being formed. Here we can give you some injection for nearly 4-5 to five months and then sperms start forming uh, naturally. Uh, this thing is work, working very well uh, with us at, uh, at, all, uh, uh, at all our All India centers. The other methods are where we go in for some surgical intervention. So for all the men who have got obstructive azospermia, we say the chance of getting your sperm would be nearly 100%. But here we carry out a simple surgical technique like uh, TISA or PISA where you put a needle inside his testes or epididymis and take out the sperms. So it's a very very simple technique and works out very well. The other method of doing the uh, giving the treatment in would be in case of a non-obstructive azospermia. But here hum sabko, we all have to know that when we carry out a surgery for an NOA or a non-obstructive azospermia we must carry out genetic analysis. So before we take the patient for surgery, we have to ensure uh, that he is genetically normal. For that, we are offering karyotyping and we are also offering for biochromosome microdeletions. Once they come normal, then we take up the patient for microtissa or we can do open surgical biopsy of the testes and get the sperms out. So I am very happy to tell you that at Villa Fertility and IVF, we have got large number of pregnancies by microtissa. And microtissa we are carrying out as a routine in all our centers and getting a uh, very good outcome. We recently had a, a case who was suffering from cancer and uh, who had no sperms in his semen sample. And at the age of, early age of 10 to 15 years, when he was a young boy, he had taken uh, radiotherapy and uh, chemotherapy that had led to azospermia in him. But after carrying out microtissa, we could retrieve his sperms and now he is doing very well and they have already blessed with a child. So in my practice of nearly 25 years in the field of uh, infertility, I have found that these, in case you have azospermia, don't become distressed. Just look around and think that one in 100 men around you are having this problem. It's a shocking statement I am making today, but this data comes from ASRM from USA and you should be all aware of that. So, don't feel disheartened. And all the men who come to our OPD with infertility, you can easily say that 10% of them are having such a problem. So, in case you have any doubts about azospermia, you can always comment in the comment section here today. In case you want to know about any more topic related to the male infertility, maybe low sperm count or poor quality sperms or how to improve your sperm count, you can always visit us. You can always write to us. Our telephone numbers are available on the website. We are there for you 24 by 7. So as I end, it was very nice talking to all of you and I'm sure it will be reciprocal. And uh, please feel, feel free to talk to us. If you like the video, please comment and share and subscribe. Thank you very much. Have a nice day.